Hello my friend, welcome back. So today is Thursday, um, it is 10 o'clock. This morning I got up and I got ready for the day. I fed the kids breakfast and now I'm making some eggs for us. The kiddos really weren't, I guess, too hungry whenever I fed them this morning. So um, I figured I might as well just make them some eggs because I was making myself eggs. That way they could eat some eggs while we did schoolwork and they weren't um, hangry while we were trying to do school. So um, we have some things to do today. Um, first off, I'm exhausted. I'm so tired today. Uh, it's been a crazy busy week, um, but we have more delivery being delivered here pretty soon between 11 and 12. So that will be like within an hour. Um, and then we have to do some schoolwork. If you are new here, we homeschool. I homeschool both of my children. Um, and then later on, we have a new gymnastics trial um, at their new facility that they're going to be going to. And we're really excited for that. And we have to leave here around 2.30 to go there because our class is um, right around that time. So we have a couple things to do today. I guess I should turn on my eggs because I'm standing here wondering why my eggs aren't cooked and the burner's not on. Mom brain. I saw you from across the room It's like we're running in circles Going around every day Getting stuck in the hurdles Of yesterday Don't you want to go further Away from the fray Let's not get stuck in our worries We'll make our way Won't you come outside Where the sunflowers bloom Breathe in the air Look 
Coco Melon is on in the background and I'm so sorry about that. <laughs> my kids really wanted to watch Coco Melon for a little bit, so I turned it on. I'm definitely picking my battles today with a headache that I have. But from Walmart delivery, I got two things of bread, a thing of bagels, and some cream cheese. Got some carrot chips and some strawberries. Got some honey ham back here and some Lysol um, brand new day scent. It's an all-purpose cleaner. Um, I really needed some multi-surface cleaner. I was pretty much all out of the ones that I had, um, and I've been out of them for a really long time. So um, I got Lysol, the yellow one that I've been using in this video, and then this one. And then I got some of this Mr. Clean Clean Freak multi-purpose cleaner. I've never used this one before, so I figured I would try it. And then this leaked um, in the bag, which is okay. Um, that's why it's all the way back here, because I need to rinse it off, but it's the Mr. Clean multi-surface cleaner. Um, in the Gain scent, I can put this in my spray mop, um, the one that I used in one of my recent cleaning videos. Um, so I figured this would be good for that. So I got that. I got some of these gluten-free sea salt chips. I got some grapes, some milk and honey hand soap. My kiddos needed some more multivitamins. Um, these are the Ollie Kids multi and probiotic ones. I thought I was getting a bigger tube of this toothpaste, but that's okay, I'll use it until I need more. Uh, but I just got the Crest 3D White. We have tons of pork chops in the freezer right now, which I hauled um, a couple Get It All Done videos back. Um, so I needed some shake and bake for some pork chops that I'm gonna make uh, probably tonight for dinner, possibly. Um, we'll see. And then I got some carb balance tortillas and some bananas. Oh, my sinuses. So, this grocery haul was pretty much just like a fill-in grocery haul. That's why I didn't film a grocery haul um, as its own video because there's really not that much. I have, excuse me, I have the hiccups. Um, I have to pack lunch for myself and both my kids and my husband um, tomorrow and we didn't have like any fruit or any lunch meat or any bread or anything like that. So I needed to get some stuff for that. And then also needed some cleaning products. So. I'm going to put all of this stuff away. Are we part of this circus? Is it a name? Feels like a heavy burden, but I can't relate. Do our actions even matter? Or is this our fate? At least now I'm feeling better I know I'm here to stay Won't you come outside Where the sunflowers bloom Breathe in the air Look up to the moon I'll meet you outside It is now 1221. Uh, we were outside for a little bit. Uh, my kiddos like to go outside and burn off some energy um, after they do schoolwork. So they started getting hungry. So we came in and I gave them some lunch. Uh, my older daughter wants oatmeal and my younger daughter wants grapes in a granola bar. Um, they're not too hungry for lunch today because they had eggs while they did schoolwork. Um, so I'm just letting them eat just a little bit. Um, that way they're not hangry by the time we go to gymnastics. We have gymnastics, um, their trial class is two, we have to leave here at 2.30, but their trial class is um, 3.15 to 4.15. Um, and then if we like it there, we can sign up for a different class. So we have to leave here um, in about, 
two hours or so. So I'm letting them just snack a little bit um, and then we will get ready to go. But while I am letting them snack, I made myself some throat coat tea. Um, I'm just letting it cook in the hot water right now. I'm so tired. Um, what I really want is a cup of coffee, but I'm also trying to be careful about how much caffeine I consume. Um, yesterday I went to the gym, so I drank an energy drink before I went because I didn't go until 8 o'clock and I didn't get home until 9. So that is usually my wind down time, so I needed something to like get me through my workout. And now because I didn't sleep well because I drank my energy drink so late, trying really hard not to overconsume caffeine today, and that's also a struggle. So what I need to do now while my kiddos eat their snack is get some work on the computer. I gotta answer some emails and things like that. It is 2.02, we have to head out here in just a little bit. So I'm about to get the kids loaded up in the car. Um, I just threw on a little jean jacket with my America shirt and some leggings and I can't even see them, my leopard vans. So the class will last about an hour and then after that we're going to head to the car wash uh, because the car wash that we like is in that town that we go to. So we're gonna be doing that as well afterwards. And then when we get home, I have to cook dinner. That reminds me to pull out the ground beef and I have to sneeze. But, so I have to do that um, so that way that falls because tonight for dinner we're making a, a recipe off the of TikTok. Um, hey, let go of that. Now that we're home from gymnastics, it's time to start cooking dinner. I'm making an easy five ingredient dinner this night. Um, I found it on TikTok and it looked delicious. So I figured I would try it. So what you do first is you start by browning one pound of ground beef. Be sure to drain the grease. I did the paper towel trick and I edited that out, but then you add in your tomato sauce, whatever kind of tomato sauce you like. I'm just using the canned tomato sauce because I like to season it myself. And then I go in with some salt, pepper, garlic powder, onion flakes, and then I do parsley, basil, and oregano. Anytime I make sauce, I always add in just a little bit of sugar because we do prefer our sauce to be sweet. And then you get an entire block of cream cheese, add that in and let it melt. At this point, I was getting my water to boil and I was trying to decide if I wanted to make both packages of tortellini or just one. Uh, we're a family of four and we could have gotten away with just one package of tortellini because we did have a ton of just plain leftover. Um, my kids did eat it, but um, I'll know for next time that one is plenty. At this point, you want to preheat your oven to 350 because you are going to be baking this dish as well. When your tortellini is done, go ahead and drain it. And then what you're going to do is add it right in to your oven safe dish. As you can see here, um, I had way too many for my dish. So I did, did just leave some plain and then take your sauce that you prepared in your saucepan and add it on top. I did end up spilling some over the side because it was a lot for this small dish, but it did end up working out. So now what you're gonna do is grab your shredded Parmesan cheese 
and I didn't measure this out, but you just wanna put enough on to cover the top of it because you're gonna put it in the oven. When I make this again, I'm definitely going to put my oven on the broil setting. That way the cheese gets like browned and crispy, but it worked really well in the oven as well, but we just prefer the cheese to be brown and crispy, but just make sure if you put it in the oven to melt the cheese on top. I probably put it in the oven for about 10 minutes. I could have left it in there longer, but it turned out so good. The whole family loved this meal. Um, my husband even went back for seconds, so it makes me happy whenever I make something and everybody enjoys it. If you happen to make this recipe, let me know in the comments below and let me know how you liked it. Like I said, this is probably gonna be one of our regular meals because it was so easy to make and it was relatively inexpensive. Yeah, we'll go downstairs in a minute, okay? Well, my friend, it is almost seven o'clock now. Um, I need to get both of my kids cleaned up because we have um, school in the morning. We have co-op in the morning. Um, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. It's free to do it and really helps me out as a creator. I'll see you in my next one.